tonight uh, the Sparta girls basketball team gets a big 63-52 win over previously unbeaten Cashton. Uh, we have Sparta coach Tracy Lindley Shandell here. Uh, talk about how this team was able to pull this thing off. Like you said, it's only the second game of the year. Uh, you got a team coming in with six or seven wins. I forgot what they're up to, but uh, you were able to hold them off here. Absolutely. So, you know, we knew coming in, you know, we don't even really didn't even have our game feet under us. And with this being game two, was really proud of the effort that the girls put forth. They worked hard. They worked together. The chemistry was there. We knew we had to contain Hyatt right out of the gates, and that's exactly what the girls did. You know, we knew we needed to create havoc, but we had to set the level of intensity right away, and and that's really what what started things off for us. And you really hit them with some balance. You had different players really step up in different times. Uh, talk about what a benefit that was for you, and and uh, what stood out to you about what some of those kids did. Yeah, you bet. So that's what's really nice about our team. You know, we do have a lot of balance, and the balance. Um, not a lot of teams can have that kind of balance where we have. You know, we've got Callie Zebel, our senior post player, who, you know, she's delivering that inside game, but yet very selfless in the sense that she'll kick it right back out. But having that balance where we can hit the three ball, work it inside, and just really be patient to get those good offensive looks. And you guys didn't lose your composure in the second half. You built a bit of a lead, casting came back, and, and then you guys held on. Um, what do you attribute that to? Well, being so early in the season. Yeah, you know, <laughs> that's, that's what's really exciting because this only being game two, um, certainly, you know, we've really been working hard with the girls on situational awareness and really just keeping our cool, keeping our head on our shoulders and not getting too dented up. And I think really we had some key timeouts that we took to kind of calm the girls down, draw a few things up and just relay to them that, look, we're okay, work together, take care of the basketball, take the air out of the ball a little bit and just and go to work. You know, we knew that we got a little antsy, tried to get some, some three balls out there that we maybe shouldn't have there for a while. but. Once we reeled them in, I think they did a really good job on balancing, taking the air out of the ball, and really getting those only guaranteed two ball looks. 